Hi, I'm Adi Sharma. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And I'm going to be talking about the delivery of my first ever grand piano today. So I absolutely love playing the piano. I've been playing for over eight years now. And uh, I just love so many composers, Chopin, Mozart, Beethoven. And I practice for hours every day. And I listen to hours for hours every day. And my teacher and I thought it was a good idea that to improve both my technique, my performances, and all that, uh, that I should invest in getting a, a grand piano. So just a few days after that decision, we went out, uh, my parents and I, to get a grand piano. And I've waited anxiously for over five weeks now. And I'm pretty excited that it's gonna come in just a few days. It is currently 9.34 a.m. And the piano delivery company just called and said that the piano is going to arrive between 11 o'clock to 2 o'clock. So I'm sort of anxious for it, but uh, really excited. Uh, the weather is okay outside, so we'll, we'll see the conditions. But I'm pretty excited for it, it coming. And yesterday night, I moved all the uh, equipment out of here that I was using for recording and everything. So it's pretty lonely looking room now. There's a cluster of books over there. You can't see them. but. There's my lonely piano bench, uh, a stool with a tissue box, and just the entire area left for the 5 for 5 grand, which I'm really excited for now. I know I've said that multiple times, but I really am. So let's wait till the afternoon, see when it comes.
So it's here, finally. Uh, the Kawaii GL30 is here. And uh, I'll give you guys a little showcase of the piano, I guess. Uh, the inside, everything about it. So let's do it. So as you can see, this is a GL30 piano. And uh, zooming out, we can see that it is quite large, actually. In person, I found that it was much larger than it appeared to be in the shop. And you can see everything from the Kawhi logo to the giant bass strings and the, the pedal dampers and everything. All the strings that extend, felt pads, so many parts of the action that make this piano just so beautiful, just make it sing so well and an overall amazing instrument. So I'm really excited. Let's just try like... something for the tuner to come in uh, so the piano is accustomed to the humidity and everything uh, so we'll be probably getting a dehumidifier or a humidifier I don't really know actually but you have to just maintain a certain humidity for the piano uh, to stay you know, high quality and not go out of tune uh, countless times in a year so uh, let's just try the same Chopin tune I played on the other three tracks <laughs> So this is the Mozart Sonata K309 in C major. This is Sonata number seven, I think. I've been doing the first movement, uh, Allegro Moderato, and uh, I'll just play a little excerpt. So much fun practicing on it it's really been such a magical experience I've always wanted to play on a grand so this is like a total dream come true for me and I absolutely love the feel of this piano the touch is just so magnificent I, I, I just feel I'm so lucky to have this uh, beautiful instrument and uh, I think Kawhi's done a great job especially with this piano I played on a lot of their um, you know GL series ones and the Shigeru's as well which were really nice but very expensive as well and this piano is just a, a combination of so many great things. I really love practicing on it. I've already also seen like aspects of my playing improve um, just from the action. The live action is so good. I can already feel the, the hammers breaking in as well. So it's, it's uh, accustomed to my touch and uh, you know the environment around it already. I also got a humidifier so uh, I can keep the humidity done well. And I don't know if it's in frame, it's right over there but uh, it just shoots warm mist, cold mist, all that stuff. So it's really important to keep the wood at, in a good con condition and also that it doesn't go out of tune too much uh, around the year. The salesman that we bought it from uh, said that I have to get the piano tuned around two times a year, maybe three, depending on usage and you know wherever it is. Um, but I think it's in a good little room here. It's compact and it's got great acoustics here too. So thank you so much again to everyone who really contributed to letting me get this piano. Uh, really excited to start recording as well. Uh, I think a lot of pieces will sound so great on this piano. I was looking at a lot of Romantic Era pieces and uh, I thought, you know, all the tonal um, colors, all the warmth in those pieces can be really uh, reflected during performances on acoustic grands. So I'm really excited to start uh, learning so many more pieces for all of you guys. I also want to give a quick shout out to my little brother here. You want to say hi? Hello. 
who has been, he was giggling about this the entire time when I told him that I want to record a cameo of you. But uh, he's helped me with all the recording stuff, so all the good audio video you see, it's all him. So thank you to my brother. And thank you guys for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I'll see you next time.